Hi, Christina's friends. I'm Kelia, the person who drew the sloths and the other jungle animals. I'm so glad to hear that you liked coloring them in. Well, I heard from Christina that a lot of you like sharks. Now, I think sharks are really cool, and I thought I would draw three of my favorite sharks, which are great white sharks, hammerhead sharks, and angel sharks for you on video so you can see how I, I make my coloring book pages. So I have this little reference, this little reference sheet. I, I looked at the computer to see what sharks look like just so I can make drawing it a little bit easier. And now just using this as a guide, I'm going to draw these three sharks just hanging out. So first off, I'm going to draw that big great white shark. And I'm starting with pencil. And you'll notice I'm wearing gloves. I'm a scientist. And at work, these gloves protect my hands from chemicals, but now they're going to protect the paper from my sweaty hands. And I'm going to draw that big body of the great white shark. Big strong body with a nice long sharky tail. Nice big fin here, and I don't mind overlapping the lines because this is just pencil. I can erase the overlapping lines if I want later. And great white sharks have nice big strong noses. And I'm going to make this great white shark smiling. Because when I draw animals, I like to draw them happy. And I'm going to give him some teeth because, of course, sharks need to have teeth. Big, great white shark teeth. And a happy eye. So there, we've got the sketch of the, the great white shark already. Oops, I almost forgot to give him gills. Sharks can't breathe without gills, so I need to make sure he has some gills. Okay, and I'm going to give him one more little fin. There we go. We've got our great white shark, and now we need to give him some friends. So I'm going to now draw the hammerhead shark. I like hammerhead sharks because their heads have such a silly shape. Oops, I made it a little too big, but that's okay. I've got pencil, so I can just erase it and try again. A little bit smaller. Nice curving head of that hammerhead. Gonna give him his body right there. And then one eye, a second eye, kind of off the end, and then again, big smile, because I like my animals to be happy. Now we need to give him some fins so he can get around. One fin second fin, dorsal fin, that's the one on the back, and then his tail, or her, sharks can be either boys or girls. And again, if I want to change something, just a quick erase, and then it's all good. And there we have a second shark friend. So we have great white and hammerhead. And finally, I'm going to draw the angel shark. I like angel sharks because they look kind of like stingrays. And I think stingrays are a really cool animal. So I'm giving him kind of a more rounded body. I think they look a little bit like puppies, like puppies that live underwater. Big happy eyes. 
nice happy smile but with teeth still can't have a shark without nice sharp teeth Again, I've decided I want to make him a little smaller, so I'm just going to erase a little bit, redraw him, and now a little pointier. Now we need to draw the rest of his body kind of scooping back, a tail, some little dorsal fins, and you know, I'm going to give him some spots. So I'm going to draw some, some nice spots here and here. Oops, got to remember that this part is the underside, so it's going to be like the belly, have a little belly line. There we go. I like that. And now we have a pencil sketch of three shark friends. Next part's really easy. I just take a thick black marker and I outline our three shark friends. So this is just going kind of along the outside because you want a nice big thick outside border for your coloring book pages. So I'm just very quickly going over my pencil tracing and this is a time you can go a little bit different from what the pencil was underneath. If you decide, you know what, I want my hammerhead tail to be a little bit bigger, I'm going to go a little outside those lines I made at first. So I've got my hammerhead. Now my great white and you know in this case I think I want his chest to be a little sleeker so I'm gonna go a little inside those initial pencil lines I drew And finally, our little angel shark. So I now have the outside borders and the eyes of the sharks outlined with my thick marker. Now I'm going to switch to a skinny marker and do some of the more detailed work. So the inside of the eyes, the teeth, ar rar, rar, big shark teeth, the nose of the great white, those gills. And this allows me to give a little more detail to the picture and also have a nice difference in the types of lines, which I think looks nice. And if you just heard a weird noise, that's because my, my phone received a text, so don't worry about that. Nice spots on the angel shark. And and there you have it. Oh, almost forgot one last thing. There we go. And now we have a coloring book page right there for you. Now, of course, I'm going to write the date which is 
April 10th of 2019. And I'm going to sign it because you should always sign and date your art. And now I'm going to off, off camera, I'm going to do some erasing and clean this up just a little bit so it'll be a really good coloring book page. But then I'm going to send it to Christina, and because you are Christina's friends, she is going to share it with you. Uh, so thank you so much for watching, and uh, happy coloring.